Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how to make enriched and breedy uranium from the Atomic Science mod. So without further ado, let's get into the video. To do this, you'll need three machines, the nuclear boiler, chemical extractor, and the centrifuge. So I'll just show you how to make it quickly. So this is how you make the nuclear boiler, just some steel plates, furnaces, a bucket, and a motor. For the chemical extractor, this will be the most expensive one. Elite circuit, bronze, motor, steel plate, and then the centrifuge, just as that, just a advanced circuit. So once you got all those three machines, we're going to set them up. So you'll need to set it up in this exact order, well, sort of. The chemical, chemical extractor will be its own separate machine, as shown, and the nuclear boiler and the centrifuge need to be arranged just like this. Nuclear boiler on the left, centrifuge on the right, they need to be exactly like that. Because a nuclear boiler, um, it produces uranium hexafluoride, and that will go directly into the centrifuge. So to make it, you will need some uranium ore. So let's grab some. And you'll put it in the chemical extractor. And I'll slowly start making it. So on this side, you'll need to put water buckets to fill it up. I'll just show you each uh, of these pieces have an animation. Uh, that will spin for the nuclear boiler, and that will spin for the centrifuge. And the chemical extractor will make yellow cake, as shown. And then you take the yellow cake and put in the nuclear boiler. And you'll need to do the same for the water. And now this will make uranium hexafluoride. I'll just wait. Yeah, so it automatically get deposited into the centrifuge, and this part takes a little bit longer, you need a lot of power, and this just slowly makes either enriched or breedy uranium. There's more, a lot greater chance it'll produce breedy. You'll probably be like getting five breedy per one enriched uranium. Enriched uranium is the more important part. That's where you use for fizzle fusion rods and all that. So yeah, that is how you get uranium.